Hey there, little ones. Welcome back to our bedtime storytelling session. Today, we have a magical tale to share with you. So, snuggle up under your blankets, close your eyes, and let's dive into the world of imagination. Once upon a time, on the beautiful island of Motunui, lived a brave and adventurous girl named Mona. She was the daughter of the village chief and had always felt a deep connection to the ocean. Every day, she would watch the waves crashing on the shore, dreaming of exploring the vast sea beyond the reef. But her people believed it was dangerous to venture too far, and Moyana's father often reminded her that her place was with her village. One peaceful morning, as Mona sat by the shore, she noticed something shimmering in the water. It was a small, glowing shell, unlike any she had ever seen. Intrigued, she picked it up, and, as she did, the ocean seemed to respond. Gently rising and swirling around her feet, suddenly the waves parted, and a graceful, ethereal figure appeared before Hera's spirit of the sea, its form shimmering with the colors of the water and the sky. Mona. The spirit spoke in a voice that was both gentle and powerful. I have watched over you for many years. You have the heart of a voyager, and your connection to the ocean runs deep. The spirit's eyes glistened like the sea at dawn but there is a storm approaching a darkness that threatens your island. Only by embracing your true path can you protect your people. Mona's heart raced. She had always felt drawn to the ocean, but her father's words echoed in her mind. I want to help my people, but how can I leave them behind? She asked, her voice trembling. The spirit smiled softly, you do not need to leave them, Mona. The strength you seek lies within you. The sea has chosen you for a reason. The spirit told Mona of a sacred treasure hidden deep beneath the ocean. Ancient pearls said to hold the power to calm even the fiercest storms. Only one with a pure heart, filled with love for their people, can find it, the spirit explained. The journey will be difficult, but I believe in you, Mona. Filled with newfound courage, Mona decided to follow the spirit's guidance. She gathered supplies, said goodbye to her family, and set sail across the vast ocean. The waves seemed to guide her, as if the sea itself was helping her on her journey. For days, she sailed through calm waters and fierce winds, never losing sight of her mission. One night, as the stars twinkled above, Mona felt a sudden pull in her heart. She looked down into the deep waters below and saw a soft, glowing light. Taking a deep breath, she dove into the sea, following the light until she reached an underwater cave. Inside, nestled among coral and seaweed, lay the ancient pearl glowing softly. As Mona reached for the pearl, the ocean around her began to swirl violently. The storm the spirit had warned her about was approaching. But Mona stayed calm, clutching the pearl tightly. She closed her eyes and whispered, I do this for my people, for my island. The pearl's light grew brighter, and suddenly, the storm's fury began to fade. When Mona resurfaced, the once turbulent ocean had calmed. The skies cleared, and the waves were gentle once more. She held the pearl close to her chest. Feeling its warmth and knowing she had saved her island, as she sailed back to Motunui, the sea spirit appeared once again. You have done well, Mona the spirit said. You followed your heart and protected those you love. The ocean will always be with you, 
upon returning to her island, Mona was greeted with cheers and hugs from her people. Her father, once hesitant about her connection to the ocean, embraced her tightly. I see now that the ocean has chosen you for a great purpose, he said, his voice filled with pride. Mona placed the pearl in the village's sacred shrine where it would protect them for generations to come. From that day forward, the people of Motunui no longer feared the sea, for they knew that their island had a protector in Moana, the girl who loved both her people and the ocean. And so, Mona continued to sail the seas, guided by her love for her island and the wisdom of the spirit. She knew that as long as she trusted her heart, she could face any challenge that came her way. The island of Motunui flourished, the ocean remained calm, and Moana's story became one of courage, love, and the unbreakable bond between the land and the sea. And in every crashing wave and gentle breeze, the spirit of the sea whispered her name reminding her that she was never alone. Thank you for joining us tonight, little ones. We hope this story brings you sweet dreams and happy memories. Good night and sleep tight.